We have some really good news about the Worlds event which starts later on this week and we haven't had a buff like this in a very long time so I think it'll be good news for a lot of people especially if you get the pass. Before I jump into that a quick reminder that you can get two emotes and an icon as drop campaigns on Twitch and this is going on for the next week. So have a look on your Twitch account, make sure it's linked to your league account and check the campaign information. You do have to watch certain streamers or participating live channels to get these drops. It's very easy to do and you can just leave the stream open and AFK to get these free rewards. So you have about another week to do these. Now moving on to this year's Worlds event. The official article about the event has been posted with all the information about it. Something to point out about the dates is this event will last 47 days. So you'll have a lot longer than usual to complete and farm tokens in this event. Now this usually happens with every Worlds. It's a little bit longer and there's a lot more patches. So you generally do have a longer time to farm. And something they always do with the Worlds event is they buff the blue essence, orange essence and mythic essence in the pass as well. So every year the world's event is better than the regular event. So if you don't normally buy passes or you were thinking about buying one or two passes a year the world's event is definitely the one to buy because it costs the same as normal events but you get a lot more and it goes for a lot longer. Now moving on to the most important buff which is something new and Riot haven't done before and it's mentioned in this article where they state since worlds is all about assembling the best team possible you'll earn 30% more objective points when you queue up in a group of two or more. Now this is a huge buff if you play in a pre-made. You'll get 30% more points and level up that much faster. So I don't believe Riot have done a buff like this before or if they have it's been a very long time since we've had something like this where you can farm the pass and tokens a lot faster just by playing with other people. So I highly recommend whenever possible try to play in a group of at least two or more people and you'll level up a lot faster and you'll be able to unlock more tokens and get more rewards in the event shop. So this is a very huge buff and I have to give Riot credit for this because farming has been a bit slow and more the same. This at least mixes it up a bit and makes it a lot faster to farm and you can get way more rewards. So a very good change but the wording does make it seem like it'll only be for worlds. So I'm not sure if it'll be in the next event pass but it's definitely in this one so make the most of it while you can. And this 30% pre-made point earning buff should apply to the infinite pass missions. You should be able to level up this mission infinitely a lot faster with this bonus and of course they do have the regular 15 missions which you can complete you can either complete the objective or earn points playing the game and you get about 12,000 XP from these missions but for most people who do play on a regular basis these missions aren't too difficult to complete you have plenty of time to complete them 47 days and if you play in a pre-made you'll complete them a lot faster in the same article both the free and paid event rewards have been revealed it's a pretty standard pass the difference is you will get a little more mythic essence if you have the pass and even if you don't have the pass you'll get some extra tokens so there'll be 400 free tokens this time around enough to buy two orbs on top of the orb that you'll normally get anyway so that's pretty much three orbs for free even if you don't buy the pass and if you do buy the pass you'll get 50 mythic essence instead of 25 this time there is a grab bag at level 50 unfortunately they haven't brought back the missing grab bag and there isn't an exclusive banner so the rewards are basically the same as the last event except you get a little more mythic essence and you get some more blue and orange essence as well but regardless of the missing grab bag you'll be able to farm and level up this pass 30% quicker if you play in a pre-made so if you do like to collect orbs and skin shards then just keep farming the pass play in a pre-made and get skin shards from orbs that way so overall I think this pass is really good I haven't seen a buff like this in a while so make the most of it it'll only cost 1650 RP just like other passes but you'll be able to farm for a lot longer and you'll be able to unlock a lot more tokens and this event will start in three days from now. Thanks for watching, see you next time.